Utah toddler with a severe heart condition is one of the first patients ever to undergo a new revolutionary program that doctors say have given her another chance at life. A special Starby Spark explains why the results have blown doctors away here. Darby? Sienna was once so weak she could hardly get out of bed. Now her mother says she's so fiery and full of energy. It's a stark difference. How old are you? Why? Little Sienna Barton's heart isn't strong enough for her boisterous soul. Yes, she was born with hypoplastic left heart syndrome. Yeah, so essentially half of a functioning heart. Two years ago, her heart gave up on her. Right now, Sienna lives in the hospital full time on a state of the art machine that keeps it beating. So it allows for her to have a good, um, happy childhood. Whereas in the past, uh, children would mostly be sedentary with this huge machine. The Berlin device gives sick children the freedom to move, which is paramount to their survival. Beforehand, Sienna's light had been fading quickly. I mean, she was very tired, didn't want to play. She she just laid in bed all day. Now she's the playful little girl she was meant to be. Exercise physiologist Jessica Pavlock says she mixes those routines with fun activities to stimulate a young patient. So if you want a kid to work on squats, you're having them do sit to stands, but they're reaching for candy. Patients like Sienna were originally candidates for the program due to the lack of other options for her health. Now she's thriving. So it's like important to bring, I guess, essentially the child back into it, bringing the joy back into being a kid. I think we've been blown away by the progress. Of Pediatric cardiologist Dr. Dr. Dan Zebel says the program is still in its infancy and doesn't come without risks. But the way it's brought his patient's spirit back is amazing. And in patients like Sienna, we see that every 30 days they're getting stronger and stronger. They're walking further. That's just her, her personality is to be fiery and spicy and that's what's kept her alive through the many times that she's, we've nearly lost her. My baby's coming back. A warning. of the program hope one day it'll transform progress for many more young patients dealing with heart failure and Sienna's mother encourages everyone to think about organ donation as her daughter's life depends on it live in Salt Lake City I'm Darby Sparks KSL 5 News yeah great story Darby cute cute girl though all right thank you